LG G Styler Boost Mobile User HD here, and today I'm gonna give you guys my thoughts and opinions on the BlackBerry Neon, guys. This is the newest BlackBerry that runs Android from BlackBerry. Uh, this phone got announced today, and it's now up for pre-orders, I believe so. So you guys can actually get pre-order the BlackBerry uh, Neon now, and uh, yeah, I'm on GSMRN.com and you got guys the specs here and all that. So uh, let's go check it out, guys. So uh, see right there, this is the front of the phone right there. Uh, not too bad. Uh, you got your front facing camera and your earpiece and all that, and your buttons for uh, more smile on the screen. Um, supposed to get released in August of 2016. It's got announced today. Pre orders are available now, but it will not be officially released until August. It runs Android 6.0 Marshmallow, Mellow, uh, 6.0.1 Marshmallow, all right. Uh, you get 16 gigabytes of internal memory with, a, a, with an a, SD card. With a, SD card slot, so that's good. Uh, the screen size is 5.2 inches, full HD, uh, so that's good. Uh, 32 megapixel camera on the back with full HD video, 3 gigabytes of RAM, Qualcomm Snapdragon 617 processor, 2610 million battery. So, uh, let's go check out some pictures that does just quick specs. I'll get into the rest of the specs here in just a uh, few seconds. I'll see if they'll show us any more pictures of the phone. There's all the pictures that they'll show us. Um, still the one that they're showing us here. Um, it, uh, it looks like the Idol 3 or maybe the Idol 4 from Architel. So that's the front of it. So I do think the Architel uh, made this phone. I think Architel made this Blackberry. I think they made it. Because I heard uh, people saying that, uh, the next Blackberry was going to be made by Architel. And I think this one was made by Architel because it has the same specs as it does on the Idol 4 from Architel. It's the same specs and everything. Um, except for Air 4 has 2 gigabytes of RAM and the uh, Blackberry Neon has 3 gigabytes of RAM, right? So that's good. I mean, it's kind of weird the Saints made by Octel. Maybe Blackberry did a Nokia move and uh, so their um, so their mobile division did uh, Octel for 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 an, for for a lot of money. I'm not sure much with X number of dollars. So uh, I guess Octel's been making more Blackberries. We'll see. This is interesting, guys. So, anyways, the BlackBerry Neon uh, has DSM HSP LTE, of course. That was announced today, July 26th, uh, coming soon in August. Um, it's a it's a micro SIM card. Uh, I don't know the weight, but I'm pretty, it's pretty sure it's quite hefty. Uh, it's an IPS LCD compressive touchscreen, 5.5.2 inches, like I mentioned, Full HD at 424 PPI, so not that bad. Uh, multi touch, of course, input 6.1 marshmallow. Uh, looks like it has stock Android on there. It probably does have stock Android on there. Uh, Qualcomm Snapdragon 617 processor. It's probably uh, octa core, probably the same chipset. I think it's uh, I think it's an octa core chipset. I'm not sure the uh, gigahertz, uh, doesn't say you get a micro SD card up to 256, up to 256 gigs. That's pretty impressive. Uh, 16 gigabytes of internal memory, 3 gigabytes of RAM, like I mentioned. The Idol 4 has 2 gigabytes of RAM. The uh, BlackBerry Neon has 3 gig gigs of RAM. Uh, the cameras, uh, 13 million pixel red facing camera with autofocus and the LED flash. Your camera features, you get geotagging, touch focus, face detection, HDR panorama, for see videos on the back at 30 frames per second. So not too bad, 8 megapixel front facing camera. Uh, before HD videos, I'm uh, I'm assuming so you get eight more pixel front facing camera, so it should it, it should do pretty well. Uh, you get vibration MP3 and all that stuff, loudspeaker MP3.5 manual headphone jack, noise cancellation microphone, uh, Bluetooth probably Bluetooth 4. Point, uh, Bluetooth 4.2 maybe or, or Bluetooth 4.1 GPS micro USB 2.0 um, sensors like. Uh, accelerometer, proximity compass. You, you, you get your standard messaging there. Uh, HTML5 browser, Java, no. You get fast charging with this BlackBerry 60% in 30 minutes. Quick card, quick charge 2.0 from Qualcomm. So that's good. Uh, you get uh, MP3, MP4, photo, video editor, document viewer, 2610 million battery. Uh, I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's sold in or not. And it's available in black. Um, 
but let's uh but let's go back to the f picture here for a second um there's the outer four that if, if if you guys could see that it looks like the idol three maybe it looks like the idol it looks like an uh an architel montez idol three in my opinion um uh, this is interesting guys so architel made this black bear architel one architel made this black bear architel made this one um i don't know who uh, made the blackberry probe i guess blackberry made that one um the blackberry probe is a very nice phone and I, and i like the probe a lot I, i'm a big blackberry fan i love blackberry so i mean this is blackberry second android phone so uh we'll see if they're successful with, with, the, with this one so basically basically in my opinion it, look, it looks like an idol three or maybe an, an uh, idol four guys um so um, I know what the back of it looks like. Um, if you guys want to know what the back of it looks like, um, shout out to TK from Total Tech, guys. He did he did a video on a Rimmer Blackberry a few days ago. That would be the third link in in the video description. Go check. That that would be the second link in the video description. Go check out his video on that. Um, and he was and he was saying that the uh, next Blackberry was gonna be made by Alcatel, and which I think this is one is because the way it looks and the same specs, it remind, the specs remind me of the Alcatel Idol Four in my opinion. Uh, but it looks like the Idol Three, maybe maybe the Idol Four in terms of the design. Um, so uh, he did a video on that a couple of days ago, and he was talking about the whole. N -n 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 -n, uh, he was talking about uh, Blackberry that Nokia move where Nokia sold their uh, mobile division to Microsoft and shit. And Microsoft bought them out, so um, you know, yeah. So that's what that is. So that's what the front of the phone looks like. If you guys want to know what the back of the phone is, go check out that YouTube video from Total Tech, and he'll show you the back of it. It will, it will have the BlackBerry logo on the back. Uh, it doesn't seem to have no logos on the front. Um, so to me, this is this to me, this is between an Idol Three and an uh, Idol Four from Alcatel, and I think Alcatel made this phone, guys. So that's very interesting guys very very interesting i don't know blackberry sold their mobile division to architel i don't know what's going on but the blackberry probe it looks better in my opinion in terms of the design the blackberry probe looks better because um because I, because i um because I, I like the um the squares design and i like this you know the screen and all that the blackberry probe is basically a passport that runs android so um that's just me but that, but that's the front of the phone right there. It looks like it runs stock in Android, maybe, or maybe it has some uh, customization from BlackBerry there, or uh, or uh, or uh, I can tell who knows who I can't tell what interface. I don't know if it, it looks like it has stock Android, but I don't think it has. Does it? I don't think it has stock Android or not. I think it has like a Alcatel UI or BlackBerry UI. I don't know, but. Blackberry has stock Android and Alcatel has their own skin, so this might be an Alcatel skin to Blackberry here. I don't know. Um, I want to know what you guys think about this. Um, and do you guys like the fact of the Blackberry um, Neon being made by Alcatel? Um, I'm not sure how much this phone's going to be. Um, hopefully, it's a lot, hopefully, it's a lot cheaper than 700 bucks when the Blackberry Priv got released. We'll see. I think it's it, uh, it's going to be a couple. It's going to be a couple hundred dollars. I say about 400. Um, just my opinion. Um, at the, I don't think it's gonna be no, I don't think it's gonna be no more than four hundred dollars. But I could be wrong. I don't know what the exact price is on this phone is. But this is fucking nuts, dude. The BlackBerry, the BlackBerry Neon is made by Alcatel, guys. Alcatel, who makes the the Idol, the Idol Three and the Idol Four, guys. That's basically what this phone looks like between the Idol Three and the Idol Four. Um, it won't show. It, there ain't no back to it. But if you guys want to know what the back of it looks like, go check out Total Text video on that. That would be the second link, and he'll show you the back of it, and, and he'll give you his opinions on it. Um, and I want to know what you guys think about a BlackBerry made and manufactured by Alcatel. Do you guys like that? Do you guys don't? Do you guys think the price of the Neon will be a little bit cheaper now because it's made by Alcatel? Who knows? I don't know. So I want to know what your opinions are about this. Um, yeah, I don't, yeah, man, they should have shown us the back of it. But I think the back of it looks like the Idol 3 or the Idol 4, so, um, yeah, that's very interesting. Um, so this BlackBerry will be released sometime in August. It's now available for, it's now up for pre-orders. Y'all got some good pre-order this phone, I guess, from, from BlackBerry's website, I guess. I'll check there and see if I can find anything about it. Um, so, um, 
this will be uh, linked in the, this will be linked in the first description box of the video. This will be the first link to guys can take a description of the same um, total text video on the uh, on the next Blackberry will be in the description box video as well. That that will be the second link in demo. Social networks will be the uh, last two ones. So um yeah, I, I want to know what you guys think about the Blackberry Neon guys. It's now up for pre-orders, but be available in August sometime. Um, it looks like it has the same specs as the Idol Four, as the uh, Idol Four, but it looks like between the Idol Three and the Idol Four in my opinion. Um, so that's what the front of the phone looks like. It only shows the back. But if you guys go check out the YouTube video from TK from Total Tech, he'll show you the back of it. So, um, yeah, I don't know what you guys think about this BlackBerry made by Alcatel, guys. I want to know what your opinion about it. Do you guys like that? Do you guys think the price would be a little bit lower now since it's made by Alcatel? Because when the BlackBerry Proof came out, it was six ninety nine ninety nine when the BlackBerry Proof came out. So, uh, it's not going to be that much. Trust me, it's not going to be that much. Uh, the, the specs are not, are, not, are not as quiet as high as it does on the BlackBerry Proof. So I'm thinking four hundred dollars for the uh, BlackBerry Neon, but I could be wrong, or maybe a little bit cheaper. So I don't know what you guys think about the BlackBerry Neon, guys. It's now up for pre-order. It got announced today. It's official. It's here. BlackBerry second Android phone, but this one's made by Alcatel. So well, uh, yeah, this is very, very interesting, guys. Um, so um, if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, guys. It really, it will really help me out a lot. Um, make sure you guys follow me on Facebook and Twitter, guys. Links for those will, will be in the description next video. Please very kind subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video. Peace.